welcome back to the Nerdy Collector and today I have received two pops in the post that I'm going to unbox on camera today. I thought I'd share with you guys what I picked up this week via the um, internet, things I've ordered online. One's from EMP, one I picked up from eBay and one is a Chase. So let's go and have a look and see what I've picked up today. We're going to start off with the EMP box which is right here. So we're going to check that out and I'm going to uh, open this box up and um, see what I've got. Shout out to Danny and Jazz who pointed out that this was on uh, EMP for me and um, give me a little discount code which I managed to get this for about £11. So that's a really, really good deal. So I'm going to uh, going to open this one right now. So uh, bear with me while I open this box. Um, it's a really good deal I picked up online and um, I'm really excited about the pop that I did get. I didn't know it was going to be released, which was the EMP exclusive, but EMP are really good guys, so it's really worth checking them out. You can pay for uh, a yearly subscription from them as well, so you can get um, cheap pops, for, because it's free 99 shipping, I believe, and if you pay £10 for the whole year, it's all free shipping. So um, here's the pop I picked up. I'm just going to take it out of the box, and um, I'm going to reveal it to you guys, as you can probably see through the plastic there. There we go. That is what I picked up. It is the Hot Topic exclusive, EMP UK exclusive, Ahsoka. Now this is from Star Wars or Clone Wars. This is a really cool looking pop. I'll let you guys have a closer look at that there. There's the front of the box. It's really nice packaging on this pop. Obviously we've got the EMP exclusive sticker there and the Hot Topic exclusive sticker there. Really, really nice pop. I'm really pleased with this. And for 11 quid for an EMP uh, exclusive and a um, Hot Topic exclusive, really, really, really pleased with uh, the price I paid for this and it's a great pop and I can't wait for the rest of the wave to be released here in the UK. Yeah, so I still haven't sorted out the lighting situation guys, so I do apologise about if the camera keeps zooming in and out. I'm, I've got to get my studio lights set up, I just haven't had the time at the moment. I've obviously got my green screen in a whole new location, so I'm really pleased with this setup. I just need the lights sorted. But I'm really pleased with this pop as well, I'm really, really pleased with the price I picked this up for. So um, stay tuned to review for that. Let me know in the comments if you'd like an Ahsoka review and hit that thumbs up if you'd like it as well. And I'll sort one out and I'll get it up on this channel as soon as I can. So guys, moving on, I got a parcel here from eBay. I really got a good deal on this Chase Pop. I'm gonna show you guys what it is right now. So let me just open this box and I'll tell you guys what it is. It's very well packaged, nice fragile tape all on it there from the eBay seller. I paid around, I paid around 14 pounds for this. That was shipped as well, so that was really nice. He's put a lot of bubble wrap in there, he or she, and uh, I'm really pleased with the price I paid for it. So let's show you guys the chase I got. It is a WWE pop, sticking with the theme of the WWE chases I'm trying to collect at the moment. It is none other than the million dollar man, Ted DiBiase. Now that's a really cool chase. He comes normally in his uh, black traditional suit with the million dollar title draped over his shoulder. But in this one, he's in his white suit with a million dollar championship chase over his shoulder as it's the chase exclusive in the white. So I'm really, really pleased with that. Managed to pick up a really cool chase for a really good price actually. I know it's normally around the 10 and you can find these people find this. It's not a rare chase. That's why I managed to get it 14 pounds shipped. But nonetheless, it was a chase I really wanted to add to my WWE collection. I think this making the third WWE chase I have, and there's only two more out there, so I'm gonna get them soon. Hopefully I need the Vince McMahon chase, and I need the Iron Sheik chase, so if anyone knows where I can pick them up for cheap, let me know in the comments below. And let me know if you'd like to see a review on this Ted DiBiase chase. Hit the like button if you'd like to see that. So this is another really cool thing I've picked up. So guys, also not pop related, I have been to Forbidden Planet in the last few days, and I picked up two NECA figures. I'm gonna show you guys what they are right now. They're really, really cool, and I'm really, really glad to add these to my action figure collection. I managed to get the Pennywise from the new IT film uh, NECA figure. Comes this really nice box with a really cool sort of open door, and there's Pennywise in there. Comes with multiple head sculpts and his balloon. It's a really, really cool pop. I'm sorry you can see the uh, the camera screen reflection there, but that is a really, really nice set. That's what the figure looks like out of his packaging. I haven't opened this yet, but I'm really, really intrigued to open it. I will display these on shelf in a box like this. I just think the box is fantastic, and I really like this. So I managed to pick this up for around, I think it was £35. So they are expensive, but NECA figures are a bit more upmarket because of the detail. So I'm really, really glad I managed to pick this one up. And sticking with the Pennywise and the It theme, I managed to pick up the 1999 Pennywise um, as well from the film from the 90s. It's a really, really cool box as well. It's a slightly bigger box than the other one. And it opens out and there we can see Pennywise inside and all his glory. Again, apologies for the screen, but there's the three head sculpts 
All the balloons were hiding in there. It's a really, really cool figure and a nice promo shot of the figure there holding the balloons. I really think NECA nailed it with these figures that I can see so far and I really, really like the look of these. So let me know, guys, if you'd like me to do reviews on these two on this channel. I would really be happy to do reviews if you guys want them. So let me know in the comments below and the like button. So, um, yeah, thank you for... Uh... So, yeah, let me know with these guys. I'm really, really pleased with these. Really good steel. I know it's not pop related, but I really think I got a good deal on those two there. So, guys, let me know what you think of the stuff I picked up today like I said let me know by hitting the like button if you like reviews on this stuff and uh, let me know in the comments down below what you think of the two Pennywises I picked up and the Chase Ted DiBiase let me know what you think of that and also the the Ahsoka from um, the Clone Wars and, def and definitely go and get yourself one of those pops of the Ahsoka ones it's on EMP right now for such a good steal you can't leave it there so guys thank you very much for watching I really do appreciate it um, like this video leave a comment down below Hit that subscribe button, guys. I really do appreciate every single one of you that subscribes. I love making videos for this channel, and I want to continue doing so. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you're notified when I drop a video. And um, don't forget to follow me on all forms of social media. I do post semi-regularly. I, I, I do try Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram linked in the description below. Hit me up on any form of those social media for a chat, guys. Some of you guys do, and I really appreciate it. And thank you very much for watching once again. I've been the Nerdy Collector, and I'll see you next time, guys. Bye-bye.